Terminus is a fictional planet at the edge of the galaxy in Isaac Asimov's Foundation series, home of the Foundation, later capital of the Foundation Federation. Topic: <laughs> Geography. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Position in the galaxy. Terminus is the sole planet orbiting an isolated star. Its nearest inhabited neighbor is Anacreon, 8 parsecs 26 light -years away, and it lies approximately 10,000 parsecs from the capital of the First Galactic Empire, Tranta, near the galactic center. There are almost no visible stars in its sky, only the huge lens of the Milky Way galaxy. The nearby stars of the province of Anacreon are known as the Diamonds with the expanse of the galaxy described as the lens. The ecliptic plane of Terminus appears to be near perpendicular to its orbit around the galactic nucleus, as the lens is visible in the night sky throughout its year, while the diamond's appearance appears to be seasonal. The visibility of the Magellanic clouds is not discussed. <laughs> Planetary geography Terminus has a very high water land ratio with the capital Terminus City situated on the planet's only truly large island not quite a continent The planetary ocean contains a total of approximately 10,000 inhabited islands Terminus's climate is mild like all known habitable planets it has a nickel iron core which produces a significant magnetic field however it has almost no metals in its surface rocks in the Foundation's early years, steel was so valuable that it was used to coin money. Biosphere Prior to human occupation, a few lower forms of life existed on Terminus. However, once humans arrived along with their supporting species, these native life forms were crowded out and became extinct in the wild. However, breeding populations were conserved at various universities. Topic: <inaudible> Cities. The capital of Terminus Planet is Terminus City. Terminus City is home to a number of noteworthy places, including City Hall, the primary administrative building of the Foundation and later the Foundation Federation, including the Council Chambers and Mayor's Office City Hall Park Cyclopedia Square Flexner — Suburb The Harden Building — A public apartment complex Mallow Hall — A concert venue The Salva Harden Museum of Origins more commonly called the Harden Museum, a museum of Foundation history, known to house the copies of the original Encyclopedia Galactica. The Selden Vault — where messages recorded by Hari Selden before his death were played to relay important information to the citizens of the Foundation, around the times of the Selden Crises. Terminus Spaceport Ultimate Spaceport Three other cities are known, Agiropal, Newton City, Stanmark Arcady Darrell's hometown. History With the Galactic Empire in fatal decline, Hari Selden, inventor of the science of psychohistory, predicted a 30,000-year interregnum of barbaric dark ages until the rise of a new empire. So Selden created a plan to shorten this interregnum from 30,000 years to 1,000 years. Selden asked Las Zeno, chief librarian of the Library of Tranta to undertake a search to find a suitable planet, according to Selden's criteria. Zeno, following a lengthy search, found Terminus, which had been uninhabited through the five centuries after its discovery. Selden manipulated the authoritarian commission of public safety that ruled the empire to exile his project to Terminus. The founding population consisted of 100,000 especially healthy scientists, whose ostensible purpose was to publish an Encyclopedia Galactica. 
In actuality, their job would be to preserve science and technology, and to reconquer the galaxy to form the Second Empire. The lack of steel and limited natural resources forced Terminians to develop technologies of extremely high efficiency, as their knowledge due to their position as the inheritors of the Imperial Library allowed them to do so. The high technology and science of the Foundation became its crucial strength in early confrontations, first against far larger local kingdoms that had broken away from the weakening empire but drastically regressed to pre-atomic technology. And later, against powerful dictators with support from the dying core of the empire itself, who had similar scientific ability to the Foundation but far more cumbersome, inefficient technology, having always relied on colossal resources. Economically, at least for the first 500 years, they seem to have a massive surplus in labor. Torin Darrell II and Yanov Palorat were both described as men of modest means, one living off a stipend, the other a quiet academic in an unpopular field. Yet both men were able to afford a house servant Polly for the Darrell household and Clodder for the Palorat household. Polly in particular is shown at length to be very undereducated, speaking in a fashion that seems indicative of the antebellum South. Whether this is due to her inherent limits, a bizarre affectation or a lack of educational opportunities on Terminus is not explained. The labor-saving devices as described would seem to be the equal or more of 20th century gadgets, and what the servants are supposed to do is not explained, though it describes them doing menial tasks such as setting out pre-made self-cooking dinners or opening doors. In the later Foundation books, primarily Foundation's Edge and Foundation and Earth, Terminus is well on its way to being the capital of the Second Galactic Empire, using its massive technological advantage. This even threw a wrench into the plan of the Second Foundation, as Terminus had managed to develop anti-mentalic technology, including a psychic barrier, which was strong enough to hold off at least temporarily store Gendable's mentalic power, and with Gaia's help had Golan Trevise chosen it would have been indestructible to mental attacks. See also Foundation Series Tranta